Hey everyone, this is Smile Bro, and you are watching the second video of my series where I talk about the stories behind my music. Today I'm going to talk about my song, Lately I've Been Feeling All Alone. <laughs> The song starts off with me singing, Lately I've been feeling all alone. And then my friend asks, Are you recording yourself talking? To which I say, Yeah. And it seems like a really weird bit to keep in a song, but it's actually the exact moment that the idea of this song started. Um, I was at an Airbnb with some friends, and one night I was with one friend talking about some relationship struggles that he had been going through and how he wanted to understand how the other person was feeling and talk to them about how he was feeling. Um, and then at one moment in our conversation, he just said that he was scared that he would be alone forever, which is always an over-exaggeration, but it's something that I think a lot of people have felt. Um, and that's what inspired me to think back on times where I had felt like I was alone or hopeless to find a significant other or alone in a social sense where you don't have as many friends as you might like or people to talk to. Um, and I was inspired in that moment and I had been making some like beats on my laptop while we were talking um, throughout the night. So at one point I just started singing into my laptop mic. Um, and recording parts of our conversation, but he was aware, um, and that's, that's how the beginning of the song started, and that's where a lot of the vocals came from in this song. I promise that I use an actual mic when I'm home, and I tried my best to replicate the emotion and the scenario again in this song, um, and was successful in some parts, but, um, a lot of the lately I've been feeling all alone is from that laptop mic recording session while we were talking about relationship woes. The next lyrics in the song are Wake up every evening on my phone, still no one to listen, oh, whoa, whoa. And this is something that I had felt outside of our conversation uh, when I had woken up after taking a nap when I got home from classes. Looking at my phone and I didn't have any notifications from anyone and I had checked all my social medias like six times that day just to see if someone like posted something new to entertain me or feel more engaged with the outside world and I had been snapchatting people but maybe just for streaks or not an in-depth conversation or deep conversation I was really kind of feeling alone and wanting to have a deeper, have a deeper engagement with someone else. Um, and that's why I feel like this song goes a lot of ways because loneliness doesn't just apply to, to one scenario. And I've felt it in a lot of different ways, um, especially recently with having all this going on around us and only being able to see a select amount of my friends and family. Um, in the last like month or so. So the rest of the lyrics in this song aren't super complicated. I actually sing, Lately I've been feeling all alone around 11 times with parts of it chopped up or pitched up to sound like a different person. And I'm really happy with how it turned out even though it's simple and it feels like an emotional drawn out introduction um, I don't know. Just talk to me. What is it? It's it's like me singing. Don't have to be all professional. Just tell me. Tell me just like as a friend. Just tell me right now as a friend. See if it looks good. What Turn. is it? Just tell me what it is. <laughs> so, it's me singing. Lately, I've been feeling all alone. With it drawn out and emotional, leading up to this intense part where you're just over and over saying lately I've been feeling all alone 
while you're dancing to it, you're entirely feeling that emotion, you're semi-emotional, you're, but you're expressing the feeling of being alone, and it's not super sad, but it kind of it's kind of sad, and I don't know how else to better say that than that. At the ending of the song, I'm talking to my friend from the first part and he says, thanks brother, that helps a lot. And that's something that he actually said to me after we finished a rough demo version of the song. Um, him and the significant person that we were talking about didn't end up working out, but we both really love the song and it's a good memory back to that time. and. Yeah, thank you for the support. I was a bit nervous talking about my emotions and being vulnerable in that last video, but I'm really glad that I did because I had a lot of people reach out to me um, in support and tell me part of their story. Uh, and yeah, so I hope to do more of these and I appreciate you guys. I hope you're doing well and I will see you in the next video or in person hopefully soon. Thanks. Smell bro out. Is that good? Uh, thanks, Sam. That's all I needed.